Hello guys, this is Daniel. We're back playing Metal Slug First Mission. We're going to the next area, which is Mission 9, Discovery of a Secret Passage. Let's see what we find here, huh? Never been here either, so we'll see what's going on. Uh, we got Metal Slug, so that's sweet. We kill a guy who was starting the fire, because we're... Oh, what the... It's one of those big old tanks. Let's get my... Bazooka ready here. I don't remember the name there. That's sad. Yeah, let's shoot these. Uh, ah, these mines are getting me. What the hell? Let's shoot them up here. Let's see if there's anything hiding. Nothing. Alright, let's get out of here. Hey, there's two guys. Three guys already. I saved three guys. Ain't that great, guys? I'm already gonna reach another level. Hey, who's here that's shooting me? Jeez! Let's keep going anyway. It's not like they can destroy me completely. And if they do kill me, what are they going to do about it? I can just jump around here. There's some gas up there. Use that. Uh, there's something here. A toilet paper. Remember, when you're going to war, you need your toilet paper. Uh, lobbing grenades here. Why am I lobbing grenades now? Can't shoot my cannon? Oh, uh, well. I lost my platforms there. Might as well go the other way, I guess, huh? Get out of here. Keep going. I wonder if I can... Why am I lobbing grenades? Another guy up here, so I say four guys already. That's good. This secret passage is already paying itself. Uh, mines, can't just go over them and not get hurt? That uh, seems like it can. Bust them up! Bust them up! Mine. A duck. Hey, how did I do that? I think I actually know how to... Hey, I know how to... I know how to rotate my tank now. You wanna do that? If you ever play this game, forward, forward, or back, back. It seems, and you rotate. That's neat. That's something I figured out today. <laughs> so cool. So let's kill all these little punks with their shields, thinking they can't die here. I think I could just run them over back there. So let's try that. There you go. Let's keep going. More of this passageway. I still love how those guys disintegrate into nothing when I kill them with my Vulcan cannon. Yep, what did I miss? Did I have to go? I made it's this yellow part more. Yeah, I destroy these. I don't want to get messed with those. Mines. Something up here. Destroy it. Anything hiding? Probably not. Just turn around here, huh? There you go. Ow! These tanks are bigger than my... Metal slug, you can get my metal slug, it's just too advanced for it. Take him down with one bazooka shot. There, they need a couple, and I have a Vulcan cannon, they don't have that. And what's that? When did I grab that? Oh, cool. Somehow shoot on the air instead. Yeah, another guy, that's like six guys already, isn't it? Amazing. Yeah, he <laughs> it kind of goes up and shoot, that's kind of weird. Got a coin. That's gonna help my continues. I'm probably not gonna survive all the time, obviously. So always good to have a little continues. See, it's like jumps up in the air. Look, ah, look, it's celebrating. It gas. Let's get that. The metal slug celebrates when it does an SS or the super soaker, as we called it in the last level. <laughs> Another guy. That's like seven or eight already, man. I wonder what my level's gonna go after this. This is just... What are you doing? They have all the prisoners of war down here or something? Just keeping them down here for what? What are they trying to prove? I'm supposed to go down, it said, but... Should I? Uh, that means there's something up here or something worthwhile, obviously. So let's see. Guy, a tank, kill it. Boom! Let's do that again. Ow. Jump in the air. You just don't kill. And I got nothing. Nothing important, it seems. No enemies. Yeah, they're back. Turn around. More tanks. Is there something? Well, I guess they're just, I'm getting closer to the base, right? They're just trying to get this tough on their tanks and everything. A lot of guys protecting there. And a lot of prisoners of war. We must be getting close to the ending, right, guys? Last time I played, I didn't went through this part, so I really don't know if I how many more levels I need or 
when will I get to that part where I did last time? So, huh, we're kind of figuring out what's going on here, huh? Yeah, a coin. Let's get that. And I'm pretty sure you can't go over there or you'll die. You going forward with your tank. No one can stop you. You have a metal slug. Hey, and there's the guy. And we're done with this level. Here we go. Okay, so we're captain now. Let's see what we get. Our new level is major. Uh, lieutenant colonel? I don't know. Colonel. Or colonel. That's colonel now. Okay, next area. Where are we going now? Mission chain. Night flight. How exciting. I've actually been here before. So I actually have some sort of idea what I'm going to do here. Flying. We're going to the air, guys. You know kill anything that comes into our way. Uh, like those guys trying to shoot me with missiles. And I got some missiles myself. So, I always wonder if I can get smushed in these parts. Probably can, so I may try to avoid it still. I wanna die, stupidly. So, just keep moving. Got a super soaker. I don't think the plane can use the super soaker. I haven't, I haven't found a way to change weapons with it, so only could keep missiles and the bombs. And the shooter only a lot of missiles. Oh, ah, jeez, this one got me. So, ah, god, ah, another one. Man, did you... You know, I, I was thinking that Marco probably did this thing at night, so that way you wouldn't have to face so many things, but fortunately, it seems like there's a lot of guys and a lot of turrets still running around uh, trying to kill them. Oh, jeez, that was close. So that's kind of sucky. I'm pretty sure that's why he decided to go on night. I mean, I wouldn't go at night flying. No. So why is he going flying at night? And then he did all these bastards are all shooting shit at him. It just doesn't help, you know. He was trying to make his life easier, and it only gets harder. But then again, isn't that the life of a metal slug unit? I mean, seriously, what the hell do I have to put up with? UFOs, zombies, aliens. Super mega size max, and you have to all do it with a pistol. A pistol, damn it! You're lucky you get a jet. I mean, this is the first time I think I've seen the jet for a while. And this is actually the first mission, so that's kind of funny because you get the metal slug and you also get a jet. But then later on, the other games, they start even missing jets and other cool stuff. Occasionally, you get some other new stuff, but you don't you don't play it with that long. And usually, the enemies are pretty tough, and they destroy your your new thing before you even have a chance to really play with it, so that's kinda sucks. And what is that? That looks like a blimp of zoom! It's gonna kill me, isn't it? And it's always shooting stuff at me. Uh, go forward. And here we meet the blimp of zoom. Ow! <coughs> Spikes in the front! Has a guy drop bounce on that thing. It has shoots things everywhere, has the couple turrets. And it's now shooting a whole bunch of bullets at me, and they also disperse. Look at that. They're breaking apart to try to get me still. What a bastard. What a blimpy bastard. So let's see, it has one, two, two turrets, obviously, and then somehow shot three things in the thing. And then it's also protecting the front, so it has some spikes. A little blimp of action there. So see, this. this this plan didn't work out for Marco very well, did it? I mean, he's trying to go at night, trying to get all inside their base and shit, trying to not get caught, and then this happens, you know? A whole bunch of crap, a whole bunch of tourists are fighting him, and then a fucking blimp is fighting him. A blimp? Someone was awake at night and trying to fight him with a blimp. Bullshit, man. This is the crap you have to put up with all the time. When you're a... When you're a Peregrine Falcon unit. Don't you get me style with this barrier unit. So, pretty shitty, man. wonder if they get paid a lot. It should be, right? They're facing things that no one's ever done, and they kill things with pistols, so that's gotta be like a billion dollars a year, right? And what if they don't get paid? That's even shittier. What is this crap? You do it for what? Killing people? Uh, I guess some people would do it for just killing people. 
I mean, would you do it, guys, for just killing people? Let me know. Put it in your comments. Tell me if you would kill for free if they let you kill people. <laughs> so let's keep going. Man, this boss is sure taking a long time. I only got bombs in the Vulcan Cannon now. I threw all my missiles at it. And it's still fighting strong. So hopefully we'll get it around the next time here. Let's drop some more bombs. No, oh, and there he goes. Exploded. Dead to the blimp. You're not going to be trying to kill me anymore. Obviously we didn't go up level here, so... Just keep going to the next era. Area. So what is we going now? Mission 11. Fortress. So I guess we now finally made it inside. And here I go, parachuting my way in. Nothing's gonna stop me now. Gonna bomb that thing. Bomb that one. I killed that guy. Whoa! His bullet got me up here. Sweet. Uh, whatever's down there, I don't have to care now. Some turrets down there too. It looks like a, some kind of tank down there. Let's kill it anyway. Get out of here. Hey, we're shooting those things. Shotgun! Get that. Oh, uh, here we go. These guys are hiding down here. Iran, I guess. Fish are more dangerous in this game than anything, really. Kill these guys. You don't want to mess with them to throw big bullets. Helicopter dead with one shotgun blast. Because that is truly like what that what will happen if you guys did it with a helicopter. You shoot it with a shotgun and it explodes. No, trust me, try it. <laughs> a lot of toilet paper running around. Must be a lot of oh shit moments going on about here, right? Need my toilet paper. Oh shit. I actually remember this fire. <laughs> I never did so well here. It died a lot. It's one of those crappy Mega Man type X things and I can never do them. Uh, what's up here? Is that a duck or is that toilet paper again? Anything here? No? Well, hopefully I do it. So here we go. Jump, 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 and I missed. Oh, jeez. Oh. Okay, so I didn't die there. Go. Ah! Got spiked. Great. Okay, then. Uh, let me just do a save state here just in case. Remember last time I almost do all my continues because of that, because I suck so bad at doing it. So, okay, let's keep going. Let's see if we do it this time. There we go. Jump, jump, jump again. Jump really fast right here. Jump super fast right here. Oh, I missed. Go, go, go. Oh, I, I think I made it. Yeah, I made it. Sweet. Uh, what's over here? Guy. Save another guy. Grab some snake. I don't know what a snake does. Got some more shotgun shells. Kill that guy. Where is there? There's nothing down here. Why is there random flames shooting about in this place? Makes no sense. Ow! I need that fish. It probably didn't really it. So, barrels that explode. Careful here. Tank that dies with one shotgun blast. I mean, I shotgun it. Shotgun's always been the most powerful weapon in Metal Slug. Gold. 5,000 points. What else is there? Hey, a coin. Sweet. Fall down. Really, what's with the random plank door parts here? What kind of machine place is this? I mean, I don't think your factory runs with shooting flame balls all over the place, you know? Unless this was like security measure, but still doesn't make sense. What happens if someone has to go down there? Do they like turn it off or is that on and they have to figure it out? I'm not sure. It's kind of sucky. So, hopefully that's not what happens. Alright. Spikes there. Gotta make sure I don't get hurt here. Piranhas. Can I? So let's see. Go to this door, I guess. Or go to that door. Uh, let's go to that door first. Let's see what's going on here. Nothing, I guess. It's going outside. So I'm guessing that's almost the end of the level. So let's see if I can get up there. Guy with bazooka thinks he can kill me. Uh, fish, let's kill him before they kind of hurt me. Ow, it got me. Uh, let's kill the rest of them before they get me again. So let's see here. Can we make it up there? Up, get there, missed. Ow, we got hurt by spikes again. Jump, doesn't make it. Jump again, can't make it. And the spikes got me again. Uh, I mean, if I do it from that side, let's go here. Yep. Yeah, whoa, whoa. Almost fell there. It's water. Because we all know. Let's go! <laughs> ah! 
I don't know if I can make it. it doesn't seem like I can, so I might as well give up. I mean, there was even a guy over there. Yeah, look like a tank. Take my bombs, tank. That but tank looks pretty big there. These guys with shields, too. Might as well bomb the hell out of them, too. Stabby, stabby. Bomb. Shoot. Shoot. Grab. Ah. Stab. Bomb. No more bombs. Just, just bomb the hell out of these guys. Jeez. They all had shields. Bomb over there. Bomb over here. Did that took out all the problem? Another bomb. No, I missed. No, I got somebody over there. Yeah, yeah! Okay. Hey, right, there you go. And there's the radio. Here we go. Yeah, we got this. And this is the end of this. So, uh, let's see what we got. What's our final ranking? We are now Colonel. And that's it, guys. See you next time.